U.S. Immigration and Customs Enforcement is reportedly considering a plan to release thousands of migrants held in detention facilities due to a lack of funding to sustain operations. Running detention facilities are some of the most costly expenses for the agency. So to trim costs while facing a budget deficit, more migrants could potentially be released in the U.S., according to drafted plans first obtained by The Washington Post. It could be a solution for ISIS budget strain, but it could also add to a problem major cities face. Migrants by the thousands are already being processed and released by other border agencies. Streets and shelters in Denver, Chicago, New York City are overcrowded by migrants awaiting asylum court proceedings. The immigrants detained by ICE are ones that cross the border illegally or are charged with crimes awaiting deportation. Because of the historic number of crossings from the southern border last year, the demand on resources is straining the entire immigration system and burning through funding. ICE has an annual budget of $8.5 billion, but faces a $700 million deficit, the largest shortfall the agency says they've faced in recent years. News of this internal memo suggesting mass migrant releases to shave costs comes after the agency was heavily relying on Congress to pass the $118 billion foreign aid package that failed this month. Nearly $8 billion of that would have gone to ICE, of which the agency would have put $3 billion toward detention efforts. But the massive aid package was a no-go after lawmakers couldn't come to an agreement on how to fund and address the border crisis. This has forced ICE to look at alternatives to cut costs, including cutting bed space. The internal proposal to save money would reduce capacity from 38,000 beds to 22,000. While this route would see the potential release of thousands of detained immigrants, it would just add to what other border agencies are already doing. Since 2021, Customs and Border Protection has documented more than 2 million migrants processed and released into the U.S.